I hope that all of you are well and managing through this pandemic. It's a crazy time where we all have to adapt to our changing habits, uh, changing our days are changing. So everyone has to adapt and try to make it through. We will get through this. Um, hi, I'm Lisa and I do play the bagpipes. I've been playing for almost 20 years now. Uh, I've played with uh, numerous bands, including the Timmins Police Pipes and Drums, uh, Northern Caledonia Pipe Band, 
Branch 23 Legion Pipes and Drums, which is now known as the North Bay Pipes and Drums. We're kind of going back to the our roots, um, which is what the band was originally called in 1926. Um, I've also played with the Calendar Legion Pipes and Drums, and I have played with the South Glengarry um, Pipe Band for a few seasons, uh, played with them and competed with them as well. So once the call was put out across Canada, for a neighborhood cheer at 7.30 at night, just to cheer on our healthcare workers and frontline workers, essential workers. I uh, stepped out of my house and played my pipes in my neighborhood. And people loved it, I loved it. Uh, the next time I went out, drummer George joined me, and six feet apart, of course, and him and I played together. Um, at the same time, Piper Rob was up in his neighborhood and he was also playing. George, again, one night joined him up there, six feet apart, and they played together. And I thought, well, I might as well go up there as well and keep my distance, but play along with them. So out of that, the piping trio was born, and Shannon, Piper Rob's wife, took it upon herself to kind of um, make a schedule and ask people if they wanted us to play on their street. And we received over 200 um, request to play on the street. So Shannon's been absolutely wonderful in uh, scheduling us and we're out almost every day and we're at numerous locations um, every day. It's been great, absolutely great. Even in the cold, it was great, but it was cold. Um, so we've been all over town and we still have a whole lot more streets and, and little areas to go to. So keep your eyes and ears open and you may hear us in your neighborhood in the coming weeks. We're hoping to um, get to almost every part of town. My favorite place to play is the hospital, police department, uh, the fire halls, and the seniors homes. Um, the seniors homes, we're playing for the seniors because they're kind of shut in and it's pretty quiet for them. So we like to give them some entertainment, but also for the nurses and the healthcare workers, the PSWs, the janitorial staff, um, we thank them. They're keeping our family and, and friends healthy. Um, and they're working really hard, so it's for them as well. Um, we do like to thank our essential workers, uh, our grocery store workers. Without them, you know, we wouldn't be able to eat. So thanks to all of them, and that's one reason why we go out to play every night and occasionally during the daytime. Um, so we do thank everybody who's, who's working to make our lives a little bit easier. And for those that are staying home, that's great too, because you're helping the cause to keep everybody safe. Um, it's been pretty exciting for me. Um, every time we go to a different location, people are so eager to see us and listen to our music. And it just brings me great joy, knowing that it brings them great joy. Um, and they're tapping their toes and sometimes shedding a tear. Um, after the tragedy uh, in Nova Scotia, we often will play a Amazing Grace as a tribute to those 22 souls that lost their lives. And it's very touching and that um, we play when we go out and it, it touches everybody. So, um, it, you know, with us out there playing, it allows us to take their, their uh, frustrated or stressful lives, you know, dealing with this pandemic. It allows them to forget about it for a little bit, forget about this weird, weird world that we're living in and kind of enjoy and relax and enjoy our music. So, like I said, keep your eyes and ears open. Uh, we may be coming to a neighborhood near you fairly soon.
Hi, I'm Rob. I'm one of the pipers from the Piping Trio. I've been uh, with the North Bay Pipes and Drops now since 2008, and I started my piping journey in 2004, so it's about 16 years. Uh, like many pipers and Lisa, I've played with uh, a few pipe bands. I started my uh, piping journey with uh, the University of Calgary Pipe Band, and I've also played with members of the uh, Calgary Police Pipe Band and uh, Calgary Firefighters. I've also played with the South Glengarry Pipe Band with Lisa, and I've also played with the uh, Smith Falls Gordon Pipe Band. Uh, as Lisa mentioned, we have been traveling around to several neighborhoods and playing. Uh, most nights it's been uh, to several neighborhoods, not just one. And uh, some of those nights have been really cold. <laughs> My fingers are really sore, really sore, and uh, it's making it hard to play. But uh, despite the cold, it's been a lot of fun. It makes me feel good knowing that uh, the people out there really appreciate what we're doing. Um, we're just doing it for fun and uh, trying to bring a smile and some joy to uh, people in North Bay. We've also had the opportunity to play for several birthday celebrations and I'm uh, happy that we were able to make their uh, their day a little bit more special, uh, especially now where they can't really get out with their friends or family and, and celebrate the way they normally would.
George on the drummer. I love playing every night for these crowds in the neighborhoods. They're always so uh, so friendly and they really love having us play for them. Uh, these are pretty strange times and it's nice to get out there and give them something a little bit different. Uh, it's it's always so nice to chat with the people after. They're so friendly and you know I think that's what inspires me the most about um, getting out there and do even more. Uh, you never get tired of that. I've been playing in rock bands my whole life, mostly as a lead singer, but my favorite instrument has always been the drums. About two years ago I joined the North Bay Pipes and Drum Band and I've been having the time of my life. It's been a real challenge and boy do I have a lot to learn. The people I play with are so much fun and after a while has developed into a pretty nice little family. This little trio is part of that family. Looking to put smiles on people's faces, and at the same time, thanking all of our frontline workers. Thank yous. going to play a tune. It's called Everyday Heroes. It was written only a few weeks ago in England uh, by a piper named Martin Gillespie and he wrote it in honor of all the NHS workers. Uh, that's their national health care system. So he wrote it, um, <coughs> excuse me, and they had uh, had it as a charity single to raise funds for the hospitals in England. So I will try to play that for you. Thank you to all the hard workers in our community and all over. Thank you so much, Everyday Heroes. Go, guys. 
One more. One more. So awesome. Okay, leave them forever. Nice and fast. Nice and fast, my boy. Put some smiles on your faces. Fast as the answer is. Fast?
Time for our next gig.